In this video, I will give you my opinion on single tossing racing pigeons, small group tosses, as opposed to flock tossing the racing pigeons. As you see with all my videos, I try to keep it as simple as possible and so new flyers and old flyers alike can have unlimited success without a lot of time. Now, for the first 25 years I was in the sport, my father was into field trials and uh, he would take his bird dogs north, south, east, and west. He would go 50, 60, 100 miles from home and during the field trial all day he would toss my birds in small groups. Ones, twos, sometimes fives. A lot of single tossing. I had great success. Well, for the last 25 years, I've had no time. I've only flock trained the birds. There hasn't been a single time where I've broken them up into small groups, single tossing, anything like that. Even crate size, I just, I flock train the birds. Now for me, I've had 25 years of tossing the birds strictly in a flock, and I had 25 years of a lot of single tossing and small group tossing. Um, I have found absolutely no difference in results. I had great results breaking them into small groups. I've had super results tossing them as a flock, which is saves a lot of time and uh, a lot easier. And I haven't noticed a single bit of difference. Um, I would recommend toss them in a flock if you don't have time. If you have time, I don't think small group tosses and, and uh, single tosses hurt the birds. I'm not really sure if it's advantageous or if it really helps them very much. Again, I've, I've done both and I have a good sample. I have 50 year sample, half and half, and I've noticed no difference in results. So I hope I helped today and um, yeah, I'll keep the videos coming and thank you so much. Frank McLaughlin, McLaughlin Lofts.